All right, lads, let's be having you. It's your girl coming at you with a bit of advice for all the blokes out there. If you're under 30 and want to be the best version of yourself, listen up. In this video, we're diving deep into seven things every man should do before 30 from a woman's perspective. We're talking about the stuff that really matters, the things that'll make you a proper catch. So grab a brew, get comfy, and let's get cracking. First up, lads, is traveling alone. Now I know what you're thinking. Traveling alone? That sounds a bit daunting. But trust me on this one. Getting out there and seeing the world on your own terms? It's life-changing. You learn so much about yourself when you're forced to rely on your own two feet. You have to figure things out for yourself, navigate new places, and deal with unexpected situations. And let me tell you, there's no better feeling than conquering a challenge and realizing, hey, I did that. Plus, you'll have some cracking stories to tell. Imagine being at a pub quiz, and the question is, what's the capital of Vietnam? And you actually know the answer because you've been there. Sorted. Traveling solo also opens you up to new cultures and experiences. You're more likely to strike up conversations with locals, try new foods, and step outside of your comfort zone. It's a right laugh, honestly. And don't even get me started on the confidence boost. Coming home from an adventure knowing you smashed it solo, well, that's a different level of self-assurance. It's dead attractive, like. So pack your bags, lads, and get out there and explore the world. You won't regret it. Next up, lads, is learning to cook. And I'm not talking about beans on toast or sticking a microwave meal in the oven. I'm talking about proper cooking. Knowing your way around a kitchen is a game changer, believe me. For starters, it's a basic life skill. You need to eat, right? So why not learn to make something delicious yourself instead of relying on takeaways and ready meals all the time? Plus, cooking at home is way cheaper and it's healthier too. You can control exactly what goes into your food. But it's not just about practicality, lads. Being able to cook a decent meal is a surefire way to impress. Imagine whipping up a romantic dinner for your other half or impressing your mates with a proper Sunday roast. They'll be well impressed, like. And let's be honest, there's something dead attractive about a bloke who knows his way around a kitchen. It shows you're confident, capable, and you care about the important things in life. So lads, ditch the takeout menus and get yourself down to the supermarket. There are tons of easy recipes online, and even cooking classes you can take. You'll be surprised how much you enjoy it once you get started. Let's be real for a minute, lads. Finances might not be the most exciting topic, but they're dead important. Having a solid financial plan is like having a good pair of shoes. It gives you a good foundation and sets you up for success. Now, I'm not saying you need to be rolling in dough before you hit 30, but having a handle on your money is crucial. This means creating a budget, tracking your spending, and saving for the future. It's about being responsible and making smart choices with your hard-earned cash. Think of it like this. If you want to buy a house, go on that dream holiday, or even just have a bit of financial security, you need to be smart with your money. A financial plan helps you do just that. It gives you a roadmap to follow so you can reach your goals. Plus, let's be honest, there's nothing attractive about being in debt or always being skint. It's stressful and it can put a strain on your relationships. Having your finances in order shows you're responsible, mature, and you've got your act together. So lads, sit down, grab a pen and paper, and start planning for your future. Trust me, your future self will thank you for it. Right lads, let's talk about fitness. Now, I'm not expecting you to turn into a gym buff overnight, but incorporating some form of exercise into your routine is a game changer. And it's not just about looking good in a tight t-shirt, although that's a bonus, like. Exercise has loads of benefits for both your physical and mental health. It gives you more energy, improves your sleep, and boosts your mood. Who doesn't want to feel good, right? Plus, let's be honest, feeling fit and healthy can do wonders for your confidence. When you feel good about yourself, it shows. And that, my friends, is attractive. Now, I get it. Finding the motivation to exercise can be a right pain. But it doesn't have to be all doom and gloom. Find something you enjoy, whether it's hitting the gym, going for a run, playing football with your mates, or even just taking a brisk walk in the park. The key is to make it a habit. Start small and gradually increase the intensity and duration of your workouts. 
you'll be surprised how quickly you start to see and feel the benefits. Chapter 5. Pursue a passion. Listen up, lads. Life's too short to be stuck in a rut, doing something you hate day in and day out. Everyone needs a passion, something that gets them fired up and excited about life. It might be a hobby, a creative pursuit, or even just a side hustle. Having a passion gives you something to look forward to, a sense of purpose outside of work and responsibilities. It's a chance to explore your interests, learn new skills, and have a right laugh along the way. And you know what? Passion is contagious. When you're excited about something, it rubs off on other people. It makes you more interesting, more engaging and more attractive. So what are you waiting for? Dust off that old guitar, sign up for that pottery class, or start writing that blog you've always dreamed of? Life's too short to be anything but passionate. Chapter 6. Learn to communicate effectively. Right lads, let's talk about communication. And I'm not just talking about stringing a sentence together. I'm talking about proper, meaningful communication. Being able to articulate your thoughts and feelings, listen attentively, and resolve conflicts constructively. Good communication is the foundation of any strong relationship, whether it's with your partner, your family, your mates, or even your colleagues. It's about understanding and being understood. And let's be honest, good communication can be dead sexy. There's nothing more attractive than a bloke who can hold a conversation, listen to your point of view, and express himself clearly and respectfully. So how do you improve your communication skills? Well, it takes practice, lads. Make an effort to really listen to what people are saying, both verbally and non-verbally. Pay attention to their body language, their tone of voice. And when it's your turn to speak, be clear, be concise, and be respectful. Chapter 7. Volunteer or give back. Last but not least, lads, let's talk about giving back. Volunteering your time or donating to a cause you care about is one of the most rewarding things you can do. It's a chance to make a real difference in the world, even if it's just a small one. Now, I know what you're thinking. I'm busy enough as it is, Stacy. I don't have time for volunteering. But here's the thing. Even giving up a few hours a month can make a huge difference. And it doesn't have to be a chore either. Find a cause you're passionate about, something that really speaks to you. Whether it's working with animals, helping the homeless, or mentoring young people, there are endless opportunities to give back. And let me tell you, the feeling you get from helping others is priceless. It's a real mood booster, and it makes you realize how lucky you are. Plus, it's a great way to meet new people and make a positive impact on your community. So there you have it, lads. My seven things every man should do before 30. Remember, it's all about personal growth, self-discovery, and becoming the best version of yourself. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. And be sure to let me know in the comments below which of these tips resonated with you the most. Thanks for watching, lads. Stay tuned for more content coming soon.